This video is about how to estimate quotients. I've got three examples I'm going to share with you. One way to estimate is to use compatible numbers. Compatible numbers are numbers that are easy to divide. What you need to do is change your dividend, which is 41 in the first example, to the nearest number that can be divided evenly by your divisor, which is 6. The closest multiple of 6 to 41 would be multiplying 6 times 7 because that equals 42. So to make this an estimate using compatible numbers, I would change my dividend to 42, divide it by 6, and it equals 7. In the next example, we're going to divide 6 into 416. Now I've taught you that when you are dividing into a larger dividend, you need to look at the first two digits, in this case the 4 and the 1, and find the closest fact, multiplication fact, which is a multiple of 6. As before, the closest multiple of 6 to 41 is 42. So I'm going to change the 4 and the 1 in 416 to a 4 and a 2. And then for every other place, it just becomes a 0. So this time I'm going to divide 6 into 420. 420 divided by 6 equals 70 because you know that 6 goes into 42 7 times and then we have 1 0. The last example is going to be dividing 6 into 4163. In this last example we have got to find a compatible number for 6 to divide into evenly that we can do using mental math. So in this case, we are going to convert 4,163 into 4,200 divided by 6. And of course, that equals 700 because 6 divides into 42 7 times and then there are two zeros left over. More examples of estimating quotients. 55 divided by 9. These numbers are not compatible. The closest compatible number would be 54. So I'm going to think 54 divided by 9 equals 6. This example is a little different because it actually has two possibilities. We can round up or down when looking for compatible numbers. 3 is not compatible with 281, but it is compatible with 270. So if I think 270 divided by 3 my answer would be 90. I could also round 281 up to 300 and divide 300 by 3 which would equal 100. If you increase the dividend to make compatible numbers then your estimate will be greater than the actual. If you decrease the dividend to make compatible numbers, the estimate will be less.